so friends up till now in three four videos i had shown you how to create a retail kfid which was rejected by the very fine officer then again maker modified it rectified the mistake that was pointed out again submitted for verification then we linked that data in crm solution to fincore solution through menu option hccfm now i'll show you the option of uh, opening of the savings bank account with the same kfid what all tabs are necessary don't visit unnecessary tab otherwise it will give you unnecessary problems and you will not be able to make out what mistake are you committing right so just focus what all tabs to be visited enter click on login here now all works shall be done in fincore right except crm wherein we have created a qfid change credentials for changing of password svs in next in next videos i'll show you how to upload signatures in this account right fincore here change the solution yes we want to change the solution the command for the opening of savings account is h o a a c s b i think you must have noted down in your diaries again noted down so i have already shared ppts on opening a savings account what process was steps you have to take, take while opening the account here i am showing you how to create open the account practically in the system live server right so i'll type this if, uh, command here h o a a c s b s b is for savings bank account click on go or enter on the keyboard you get this screen again here so by default open has come here right i'll type the qfid here or i can again friend in need at a friend in need searcher i can do that but since i remember the qfid i'll type it 2309 here so just click elsewhere so that it doesn't change now screen code this tab is of paramount importance under which scheme code i am opening the account there must be many variants of savings or currents or term deposits in which accounts are open since this i am opening savings bank account i don't remember what the code is again i need the help of this friend my searcher here friend in need here sb automatically is coming here now i need the code here i don't remember it i don't know and so never it's always easy to choose from here in case typing you may miss, make a mistake here now sb gen general category sb gen here click on this hyperlink here left hand side you can see savings account regular so i'm opening a savings bank regular here click on go here i get this now i'll explain these tabs here which are mandatory here general details mandatory interest details mandatory scheme details mandatory if nomination is y then we add and y here in nomination tab here and again we visit nomination details otherwise if it is no it is account does not have any nomination we need not visit this but related party tab has to be visited even if it is a single account only right so this is related party details is for opening joint accounts either in retail or corporate account openings right don't have to visit these tabs mis payment details otherwise if you enter these tabs it won't let you come out in certain cases and they, the system asks you to fill up certain information which may not be required which will again give a fatal error at the end of submitting the system for verification ffd document this is for loans account limits this is for loans here now general details very important is this account statement by default it is showing both both means statement as well as passbook but we generally issue passbook here in savings so we'll be choosing passbook here of course we can provide a statement on request of the customer that is but here we will be choosing this only right okay mode of operation since this is an individual account 
I will be showing you how to add and detail into this. So I'll just choose here self here, right here. Okay, and let's scroll down. If any field is remaining, I don't think anything is remaining here. Preferred calendar base Gregorian here. This is mandatory here. So this is all there. I'll just and fin uh, fin course uh, system. You can just validate see if you have left any field. In CRM, we could not do anything, just keep on validating it, right? So, I have entered everything here. Interest details is of very important tab. We pay interest on savings bank account. We charge interest in savings bank account in case OD is created here, right? Don't change these customized fields. If you make any mistake here, system will give you an error. Because these are the parameters defined by the bank that in savings bank account they will pay not less than 4%, not more than 7%. Now, if interest is credited quarterly in the savings bank account generally, so drop down in which account the interest should be credited. It says operative account, original account, payment account, parking account. So, in India, generally the practice is we either pay interest in the same account or we charge interest in the same account in both the cases for certain countries customers have the option okay don't credit interest in my original account please credit it in some other account so he can choose operative account and enter the operative account details here so i'll be choosing original here so you can see here if it is another account we have to add another account debit account credit account details here if the account is debited for interest in case of overdraft original account right don't have to change it so automatically you can see this sbgn is the rate code that is there account pegged no don't change this right now frequency please remember these two basic fundas the day you are opening the account please enter the date of the quarter next quarter so here it shall be 30th september 2018 since the eod had taken place in month of july 2018 this date has to be like this and this has to be 31st of july 2018 since that otherwise the date suppose you are opening on uh, today's date let's say it is September so here it will be 30th September and here also it will be 30th September this date is wrong here again see so your system would have given me a warning this date is wrong here September has 30 days only July has 31st in month in the month you are opening the account next quarter date shall be the interest credit date next month end date will be the interest debit date in case OD is created if OD is not created system won't charge any interest now you can see here automatically these fields have changed here this is quarterly here this is monthly here calendar base Gregorian in Muslim countries Hijri calendar is used we use Gregorian right again Gregorian don't change anything interest compounding frequency if you make mistake anywhere here right I'll just show you the drop down daily monthly compounding it is all customized here don't change anything otherwise there will be lot of problems for you right so let's see if any field is remaining i will valid validate now scheme it is only nomination i am leaving it as no if i make it y then i have to visit this tab otherwise i am leaving it no i don't have to visit this tab I have to visit this related party details. Click on this tab here. This first page reflects all the data original account holder. First account holder details are here. Suppose if I want to add any other account holder into the individual account or make it a joint account, I have to click here and same field will appear. This is all blank here. So I must have the KIF ID of the second account holder all the data will be populated automatically so i can show you or i'll show you later on also when i'll be opening and making it converting into a joint account etc right so 
let's see if it is there i think we have entered everything let me validate here enter a value so relationship type i told you it was not to be entered here so i'll come on this first record here right let's see this is i had clicked on this validate and submit i'll get account number here so this account has been created here right so you note down this account number for verification on the account opening form and which can be verified which has to be verified which i'll be showing you in my next video here so i hope this process was clear to you and in verification also i'll log again